Hi everyone, um, I wasn't expecting to have to make this video so early, but um, I have some unfortunate news. Uh, you probably saw it in the title, but um, here, let me just boot up the world real quick. Um, I just lost my, uh, 96 day hardcore world. Um, that's not super long. That's even shorter than my last hardcore world. Um, the other one I had, I beat the dragon and stuff. So, uh, it's not like a super long time, but, um, I'm kind of sad about this one because I put a lot of effort into making some cool things that uh i've never really done before in minecraft and um really just putting a lot more effort into like the uh building side of it and trying to make everything look nice um i think i did that pretty well um this is my like cabin and uh here let's just go take a little tour shall we so i never got around to decorating the interior um apparently these items are super rare so i kept those as decoration um i had this uh pot here that uh here i'm not sure if i can see it but uh it's made with four pottery shards which is kind of cool i had a bunch of different like um barrels up here um i had a, like a turtle helmet as well uh that was uh, something I never ended up getting to use, but I put some effort into getting that. Um, I had this thing with all a bunch of different, like, a uh, bunch of different items. Flowers in this one. This one's all, like, my rare stuff. I got, like, a heart of the sea. Um, decorations. There's just, like, a bunch of random blocks in these ones. Down here, I never ended up getting to finish my uh, enchanting table thing. I had just a bunch of random stuff in here. Um, I'm not sure how much of it was good. I made sure to keep all my, like, low durability tools. I had a trident, too. Wow. Cabin. In all the flower pots, my main goal was to try and get, like, one of every flower and plant them outside my house and i think i got all but five which are all like the uh kind of harder to get ones as well as the uh blue orchid that spawns in swamps exclusively i had a pumpkin farm as well as an egg farm and a sugarcane farm because i didn't want to rely on steak or anything like livestock related for my main food source in this world so I ended up just doing pumpkin pie instead. And for a while I was living off of sweet berries, which is why these are all planted outside my house. But um, the sweet berries just sucked and they put my life in danger a lot. So when I was finally able to get rich enough to start making a uh, pumpkin pie, I thought that was pretty cool. This is a turtle. I ended up hatching a bunch of turtles in my attic when I was getting that turtle helmet. This one just for some reason ended up waddling up on my dock and just never had the motivation to leave. I think he's been here for like 40 days or something. He's been there for forever. How I died was I went down here. This is how I got into my uh, big cave system. Um, I did it through a water cave because I just ended up finding this randomly one day and I kept using the water cave entrance because it was safer than going in an area where a bunch of hostile mobs could spawn. Now this is the cave that ended up leading to my demise. Um, I was working on lighting up everything around here. And um, right here, I think, is where it was. I was trying to place a torch up here. And um, I, don't, I don't even understand why I was doing this, but I dropped down, I like, <laughs> I like jumped from here and I was trying to place a torch up here and I fell through here to the bottom and I saw like this and I was trying to MLG and I failed. Um, I think the shield procced for a second and that's why I ended up leading my demise. I might have also just been bad.
Unlucky. That's what led to my death, unfortunately. Um, it's not the end of the world. As I said, it's like day 97. I'm just a little bummed out because I had some cool projects that I was planning. And I still can do them, but uh, I'm just going to have to start a new world and get through the early game again, which kind of sucks. But I think I'm going to start prioritizing getting decent gear. So this is probably my favorite project I ended up doing in this world because I actually ended up finishing it. Um, I wanted to make a uh, cow farm. And originally my plan was I was going to make a Stardew Valley style farm. I was going to have like one of every livestock in like a uh, little area and I was going to stylize it like Stardew Valley but um, I just I decided instead that it would be funnier to <laughs> build just a random McDonald's with a vacant parking lot in the middle of just like an empty field um, <laughs> because I feel like I feel like pretty much anywhere you go you, you can find a McDonald's I felt like that was a pretty creative way of hiding a cow farm um down here i just got this all stylized um and i was starting to populate it with cows but i didn't get super far so you know i think it was still a uh, still a cool build um i don't think i'm gonna do it again i don't think i'm gonna do any of the stuff that i did in this world again in my next attempt except for maybe the pumpkin pie pumpkin pie is really good but um, I might look into other food sources because, uh, <laughs> you know, pumpkin pie was an interesting idea, but I think the concept could be taken even further. This is the end of this world. Um, some people have recommended that I uh, cheat to bring it back, but um, I don't know. That's just, that's not in the spirit of hardcore. I'd feel really scummy for doing that, so I'm not going to. Um, I'm going to start a new world because I do really enjoy hardcore, but, um, yeah, so I'm going to try to record or stream pretty much every minute of that world from the beginning. Cause I started this one offline and just sending screenshots to my friends and stuff. But, um, you know, I really, I had a lot of fun making the, uh, FNAF review video with, um, <laughs> hardcore gameplay in the background i don't know why i think that uh that format's really fun so i'm gonna keep making those videos except i'm just gonna do it on a brand new world and uh you know what we're just gonna see what happens but uh yeah real bummer i lost this one but it's not the end of the world all right <laughs> i guess it literally is the end of this world but uh there's always another